yes platform always comes up and you have to be very strategic and savvy in how you present it. It's very general, like anxiety. I'm writing a book about anxiety. For platform to matter, you do need to be like huge. Like a, a mil if you expect to break into the anxiety space, you need to have like a million followers because it's there's big people that are sort of category killers. Um, and but they were saying, but the, when you get into sort of like more like the nicheified space of of those categories, where it's I I don't know maybe teenagers and anxiety, which is a topic. If you're the person on that, you might only have ten thousand followers, but in that niche you are dominant or competitive, then you can make a strong case for yourself. So I think it's good to think about like kind of what. As much as publishers want to support and, you know, push your book out there and find your audience for you and help that help you get your book um, sold, the lion's share of that work really is your responsibility as the author. And so they want to make sure that you have confidence and connections and the ability to get to your audience. I would say it's about 70% the responsibility of the author and 30% the responsibility of the publisher. That's kind of how it's kind of mapping out these days.